today we are entering in the age of big data. A lot of people speak about uh, how to use the big data to solve the problem. In particular, we will focus on a different approach. We will focus on uh, personal big data. So the kind of data you can get from uh, the smartphone, that is the social sensor that you bring with you all the time. We can get information about the interaction you have, the places you visited, where you go. And from this information, uh, we can use this information to solve a lot of problem and challenge of our society. We can use to understand, for example, the spreading of epidemics. And in our case, we use to solve a big problem of our society, that is the crime. So we use to understand if in a metropolitan area there will be high crime or low crime. And this is really important. So this is the thing we have uh, to think about when we discuss about personal big data. So that this kind of data can be used to, for the social good, can be used for solving challenges of our society, and can we use to design a system to have uh, a better society. The science behind is the following. In order to predict crime density as spatial and temporal problem, we did large-scale data processing of anonymized and aggregated mobile network data from London metropolitan area, which is known as footfall data. Also, we used some open data such as London borough profiles, which characterize economic and political life in each area and uh, uh, crime cases reported. From this data, uh, we extracted features which characterize uh, human behavior on the basis of regularity and diversity. Then, we searched for the best statistical model which generalizes well for our recognition problem. Finally, we did prediction and visualization. The predicted crime level is not too much different from what is actual. That's it. That's simple. So the real important thing uh, that we have to discuss and we have to reason about is uh, that the personal big data can be really used a lot for solving problem, problems of our society, to solve the challenge of our society and the society of the future. So we can use the personal big data to design systems that are able to give uh, to us a better society and a better life. Mm -hmm.